Well, this is all part of an ancient landslide zone. The whole area is unstable. Right. The way the, blood, the geology in the area is naturally occurring, you're going to get sloughing and landsliding naturally. In a this is not area. sloughing. Well, this is what we call a coastal bluff landslide. Right. And the material here, just because it doesn't have high, what they call high cohesion, it just wants to slip into the ocean. And you also have uplift. It's wet. Area. If you felt the rock, it's wet. It's yeah, that's, that's the same thing as, as Portuguese band. Right. Same thing so what's here. happening is the continental shelf is pushing up under the geology here. Uplifting the slopes here, the slopes get over steepened. The material is not solid, uniform geology. It's sand, basically sandstone. It wants to slip towards the ocean. So continually moving towards the ocean anyway. So when you say cause, we call it act of God or a natural event occurring. What the problem is, a lot of the infrastructure is in the way. So our infrastructure, LA County Flood Control District, is the drains that are along the line here. LA City is a power line, sewer lines, and a uh, roadway. So that roadway, Pesad Del Mar has been suffering uplift and pushing out to the ocean for some time. And there's been some work by the city over time to secure that in place. And you'll see some of the retrofit that was done and some retaining walls were placed here several years ago. That infrastructure continues to now move and it's moving. So it's trying to hold back. It's actually tied into the slope and it's trying to hold back. So you'll see when we get out here where it's tied back. So really in terms of cause, again, the way we see it currently is it's a natural occurring event with infrastructure mixed up in it. Okay. So we go out here and we want to be real careful how far we go. We'll show you all the slide itself, some of the repairs that the county has done. And our operation right now is to move our infrastructure out of the way and drain it to the ocean so we can continue to drain the properties up here. So fairly dramatic out here, you'll be able to see the drains already drop down the slope and it's in the ocean, portions of it. You see all the above ground out over here. Mm -hmm. My name is Mark Pastrella, Assistant Director of Public Works. We're, we're currently at this, this site. We are stabilizing all the utilities, and our main concern is safety of the public. We're, we're um, ap appealing to the public's sense of safety and common sense not to enter into the area because it's a very unstable condition at this time. Well, what I learned here today was it's, it's a very serious situation, uh, one that we need to stay on top of. I mean, just in the last 10 days, I was out here 10 days ago, the movement has been dramatic. I mean, where a wall was totally in place, now it's cracked and moved and, and lowered. So we have a very significant situation here and trying to get both ends as it relates to water removal. but. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, working in conjunction with the City of Los Angeles and their responsibilities relates to the road and other things, uh, uh, we just need to keep working together and get this thing done and uh, separated so that we can look at a potential solution at some point uh, once the city gets done with a geological uh, survey.